Hi guys, I'm Lyle from the Net Ninja and welcome to this course on testing with the Django web framework in Python. In this series, we're going to introduce testing using Django. So let's get started and dive in. Now there's a couple of prerequisites for the course. In order to get the most out of the course, you should have an understanding of Python already. And it would be helpful to have a basic understanding of Django's core components like views, models, templates, and forms. And of course, you can check out the Net Ninja courses on Django and Python if you want to learn more about these topics. Now this is going to be an introduction video, so we're going to start with an overview of testing here. Now testing is a vital part of modern software engineering. It helps you develop robust and secure applications and it helps prevent bugs in your code base. Testing will also give your developers confidence as the application changes and it provides a sanity check for developers when you're working in teams and you're merging new features into your code. By running a suite of tests that helps you ensure that the application continues to work as expected. Now in this course, we're gonna give an overview of testing key components in a Django web application, and that includes models, views and templates, forms, authentication, signals, and middleware. And we're also going to look at some more advanced concepts, for example, mocking external services, performance of tests, and how you can improve the performance of your test suite in Django. And we're also gonna look at code coverage later in the series. So I've got an outline of the course here. We're gonna start with this introduction and we're gonna move on in the next video to testing in web applications. And we're gonna look at an overview of that, including the benefits of testing. And then we'll introduce the Python unit test module before moving on to testing in Django, including testing Django models, database constraints, and also looking at views, forms, authentication, and some of the other topics that we just mentioned. So that's an overview of the videos that's coming up in this course. And we also have a GitHub repository for the code. And I'm on the page for that just now, and it has a name of Django testing series. And the code for lesson three, which is the lesson where we start writing code in Python, that's here. And we also have the code for the Django sections for different lessons in different Git branches. So if you want to view the code, for example, for lesson eight, you can go to that branch and you can see the Django project here and the code for the tests and all of the setup that goes into those tests. So the repository is available if you want to check out the code, if you want to follow along with the series, there'll be a link to that as well. And with that, we're gonna get started and we're gonna start with an overview of testing in web applications in the next video. 